One of the girls accused in the Slender Man stabbing case says she might try to kill again if she's released from jail. The revelation came during a court hearing where a judge is trying to determine if Morgan Geyser should be tried as an adult or a child in the case. 12 News Nick Bull is live in Waukesha. Nick, the hearing is over, but there's no decision just yet. Now, Patrick, the judge said he wants to take a few weeks to decide what is really a very gray area of the law here in Wisconsin. What's the appropriate way to try a young girl with severe mental health problems accused of an adult crime? Hands and feet shackled, 13 year old Morgan Geyser fidgets as psychiatrists testify about her rare early onset schizophrenia. The doctors say it was behind Morgan's plan. She and her friend Anissa Wire are accused of acting out, stabbing their friend nearly to death because of the delusional belief in the internet character Slender Man. She continues to believe Slender Man is real. She continues to believe that she has an ongoing relationships with several uh, characters from the Harry Potter book who come and visit her and who she feeds and who sometimes sleep over. A psychiatrist who's met with Geyser throughout her detention says her psychotic symptoms have gotten worse. Well, somebody with severe schizophrenia um, is going to predictably do poorly in the criminal justice system, and we have hundreds of examples of that. It is a dangerous illness, untreated, and hence we're here. Another doctor asked Morgan what she would do if she were released back home, and Slender Man told her to kill again. Well, if, if he told me, meaning Slenderman, if, if he told me to hurt more people, I'd have to do it. Uh, if, if he told me to, to break into someone's house and, and stab them, I would have to do it. Now, a judge uh, will decide, as we said, over the next few weeks whether to send these cases, both against Morgan and Anissa Wire, to adult court or have them in juvenile court. Reporting live here at the courthouse in Waukesha, Nick for WISN 12 News. Patrick? Nick, a question for you. Is it possible that one could be tried in the juvenile system and the other as an adult, or would they both be tried together? Uh, they'll be uh, decided separately. Uh, Morgan, of course, uh, has the severe mental illness we talked about today, but also she was the one uh, accused of holding the knife in the stabbing. So there's a lot of different factors for the judge to consider. He'll consider each girl individually. All right, Nick, we're live in Waukesha tonight. Nick, thank you. The victim, 12 year old Peyton Leitner, has physically recovered. The doctor who treated her said one stab wound was so close to her heart, she was within a millimeter of certain death. Leitner was able to return to school last fall, a few months after the attack.